Hey, what's up, guys? You might have noticed that I didn't make a video yesterday. Well, I actually tried to, but every time I started to record, I got this in like 30 seconds and it would say, your memory card is full. And that was very frustrating. So somewhere along the way, I had messed up my SD card, my memory card for my camera. And so I take it out of the camera and I plug it into the computer and I'm trying to fart around with it and figure out how to like reset the memory or something. And like an hour, hour and a half into this, I realized, A, I wasn't going to fix the memory card, and B, I think SD cards are only 20 bucks, and I'm spending like an hour and a half on this, and my time is worth way more than 20 bucks. This is dumb. I should go buy a new SD card, a new memory card for my camera. And you might be asking, okay, so what are you telling me this story for? Well, I had a goal to make one video a day, every single day for 365 days, and hopefully along the way, I would get better at making videos, I'd get better at communicating on a camera, and I could upload them to YouTube and start building a YouTube channel and hopefully helping other people. But then life happened. And it wasn't some massive, crazy thing. Nobody died. My girlfriend didn't break up with me. It was something dumb. The SD card simply was full. But this meant I couldn't make the video on the, the camera that I wanted to make, or on the camera that I wanted to make it on, I would then have to go to Walmart the next day, so I'd have to take time on my day. I'd have to spend another $20, and even though it's $20, that's another investment into this school, and so on and so on. And oftentimes, it's these small, stupid little things that come up in life that's going to stop us from being successful. That's going to stop us from the execution, which gets us to our goal. Or as we enter into December, this is inevitably the time when everybody is starting to set goals for next year. And unfortunately, what's going to happen is that an entire year is going to go by. And then a lot of people are going to find themselves in December again, looking back, and they're in the same spot that they were. And typically, this is because these life things happen. Maybe it is more serious. Maybe your girlfriend breaks up with you. Maybe somebody in your family dies. Or maybe it's just something small, like the SD card that interferes with your momentum. Regardless... In between today and 365 days from now, life is going to happen and things are going to present themselves to stop you from hitting your goals. I used to be the one that bought into a lot of that YouTube stuff of, oh, set these goals, write them down, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And maybe I wrote them down every day for 60 days. And then a year would pass by and I'd look back and I hit none of the goals. And I got very frustrated because this happened not once, but twice or more times a year would go by and I wouldn't hit any of these goals it wasn't until I discovered a little pivot I'd still have these goals but I'd boil it down to one or maybe two goals and then I'd ask myself a very important question which is what are the actions that I would need to take in order to hit these goals and then I would make those actions my actual goal so much so that they were the number one most important thing that I would do every single day. Because I knew that if I just executed the actions, then inevitably I would hit the goals that I originally set. But on top of that, I wouldn't grade myself on how I felt about the executing daily the actions that I needed to. For example, making a video. Even if I thought the video sucked, that wasn't the point. The point was just to make another video. And by volume, you create momentum and progress. And what's crazy is that when I took that approach, not only did I hit my goals, but I hit them way faster and by it, I blew them out of the water so much more than I thought I would. And so if this story or situation sounds familiar to you, you know, that's my suggestion to you is focus on one or two big goals Ask yourselves the actions that you would need to do every single day in order to push yourself closer to those goals and hit those goals, and then make that the number one priority. Make that your goal every single day to execute on that. And don't judge yourself on the qualitative aspects of executing on it, on those actions, but just continue to do it over, over time. And I promise if you do that, you will move so much closer to your goal and you will actually hit the goal. So better to have one goal that you blow out of the water than to have 10 that years go by and you never get closer to it. Anyways, I had that insight from yesterday. I wanted to jump on here and talk about that. 
If you found this video useful, I appreciate if you give me a like, subscribe, a share, something like that. Probably helps build this channel up and get it going. I hope you found this useful. I will see you tomorrow.